teams are coming out on the pitch. And the winners of this game will go on to meet Zambia. But uh, we reckon it's going to be a tussle. I'm with Mark Rodden, who's going to be providing expert analysis. I'm Jonathan Story. We hope you enjoy this game. We reckon it's going to be a real cracker. Mark, what are your thoughts about these teams as we see them come on? Yeah, well, Ghana are slow starters, I guess, in their opening group game against Botswana, but in the crunch game in the middle against Mali, they really showed their class, winning that comfortably and coming through a tough group. Tunisia rested a lot of players in their last game as uh, they had already qualified and ended up losing that one to Gabon. Eight changes there were to the team as uh, Sammy Trevelsi had his eye on the quarter final. And uh, it'll be interesting to see how they bounce back from that defeat. A very tough game. You'd have to say that Ghana are the favorites. And now the team hymns. And we start with Ghana. national hymn and now for Tunisia. And so here we are for this Africa Nations, Africa Cup of Nations quarterfinal, Ghana against Tunisia here in Franceville, Gabon's second city, 50,000 population. It's going to be hot and humid. We'll see how these teams deal with that. And uh, really, you can only say a smattering of uh, supporters in the stadium again. Rather a disappointment, I think, overall in this tournament to see how few people have been able to get to these games. So let's have a look at the Ghana lineup. Of course, the talisman for them, number five, John Mensah, the captain, forming a solid backbone in the defense. And then two attackers, Guyan, Asamoa, extremely dangerous players. In fact, that could probably characterize the, the Ghana setup. Very dangerous talents indeed. And Tunisia, who we know are an extremely well organized side are really going to have to be aggressive. And that's the words of, uh, what's well, the word used by Sami Drabelsi to sum up his approach to this game. The referee, Alum, Alum Neon from Cameroon, and uh, tosses the coin. And, uh, Ghana get the choice. So the prize for victory in this game a semi-final against Zambia, and here's the Tunisia side. 